The Senate has summoned the Director General of the National Boundary Commission, Adamu Adaji, over the partition between Edo and Kogi states, particularly the portion between Okpila and Okene, the border crisis which had escalated due to the battle to collect revenues in the affected areas along the okene okpila ogori axis for decades by the community leaders and youths, has claimed several lives over the years while property estimated at over millions of naira had been destroyed. To this end, counsel to one of the states, uh, Ayuba Gua brought the petition before the Senate Committee on Ethni uh, Ethics, Privileges and Public Petitions. For hundreds of years, the people of these two communities, Okwila and the Ebiras, have known their boundary and respected it for hundreds of years. To justify this, in 1937, the colonial masters issued an intelligence report confirming this boundary. In 1954, the colonial government issued a legal notice defining this boundary in clear terms. All of a sudden, the boundary became contentious, particularly on the part of our Ebira neighbors, and they insisted that the legal boundary should be abandoned for no reason. This thing would have been settled, all these people would have come if the DG has done his, uh, his work. I'm not opposing if you are inviting Igbera, no Igbera. The most, they, are, they did not even write anything against Igbera. They are talking about the DG who have refused to do what he ought to do. So it is better, Mr. Chairman, to call the DG. The DG, it is only what he said that we necessarily whether you will call Igbera or not to call Igbera. Because if you call the Igbera and the Igbera people come here that day and the DG is not here, the matter will not be solved. So the DG should be called and asked why is it that makes you not to elect what you're supposed to do. This matter has been settled before. It's only because they have not done so that these people, they are, they are now clear themselves. Well, I don't need to comment much on uh, the DG's inability to be here. It is a disrespect to the institution of the Senate. For you to be invited for this sensitive EU that is causing life and properties in your domain. And you hold a position of office to give clarifications. You never even bother to even write a letter back to this committee of reason for your absence. It's a disrespect to the institution of the National Assembly. Oh, number two. Uh, the DG, it is important for you to be here at the next agenda that will be announced very soon. 